morning, GMS. I'm Davis. And my name is Ava. And welcome to the GMS News Show for the week of October 28th. This month's new root value is courage. Sometimes it isn't what you do to show courage. It's how you support your friends so they can show theirs. Be supportive, stand up for your friends, and help them show courage today. October is National Bully Prevention Month. Cyberbullying is a bullying that takes place on a digital device. If you feel that you are being cyberbullied, don't, do not react to that and block the bully and tell an adult. It is not too early to order a yearbook. You can go to the you can go to the GMS homepage or go to yearbookforever.com to order yours. If Mr. Dean didn't order his sixth grade yearbook, um, he, he would not have this amazing picture to share with us. The holiday is right around the corner. If your family needs assistance for Thanksgiving and or Christmas, GMS has several community partnerships that can help you. For more information or to sign up, please contact Mrs. McGuire. Ella's frozen yogurt will be here next Tuesday, November 5th. The cost is $5. Remember, make a reminder so that you can enjoy a tasty treat during lunch. Now let's go to the interview of the week with Eva, Top Trending with Dominic in Sports with Sam. Hello, my name is Eva and I'm here with the interview of the week with Mrs. Reinhardt. How are you today? I'm good, how are you? So, our first question is, what did you do before you became a librarian? I was a teacher here at Greenwood Middle School for nine years. I taught eighth grade language arts and then seventh grade language arts. What's your favorite book and why? Uh, the book that made me a reader was The Indian in the Cupboard. I read it in elementary school, and I remember going home and talking to my grandma about it and thinking this was the best book ever. Um, and then in high school, my favorite book became To Kill a Mockingbird. Um, I really identified with Scout. I wanted to be the little girl that ran around the neighborhood in my overalls um, terrorizing other people, and my big brother would save me. So, um, What do you like to do outside of school? Um, I like to spend time with my family and my kids. I like to read and I love to travel. So if I can pick up and go, I'm off. I love to go anywhere and everywhere when I can. What is it like working at the same place as Mr. Reinhardt? It's great. We don't actually see each other as much as people think, but we do eat lunch together every day. And right now we're about three-fourths of our way through Cheers, which we watch every day at lunch because when we're at home, the only thing on is the Disney Channel. So it gives us a break from that. Thank you so much for doing this interview with us. Thank you for interviewing me. Now back to the studio. Does that work? Hello and welcome to Top Trending, where we discuss the latest trends of the week. I'm Dominic. Number three, the NBA season. The NBA season got underway last week. The Pacers dropped their first game against the Pistons while trying to develop chemistry with all their new players. The latest NBA hype machine, Zion Williamson, grinded to a stop when he injured his knee in the preseason. After knee surgery, he is expected to miss the next six to eight weeks. What are you looking most forward to during this NBA season? Number two, Gyobit. The new Gyobit device is a keychain sized device that allows you to keep track of your child's whereabouts without needing them to get a smartphone. The device can be connected to a kid's belt loop, shoelace, or backpack and uses a combination of cell phone data, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and GPS to allow a parent or guardian to track where the child is on the device's phone app. The device is aimed for younger children but can even be used for pets. Number one, the new Star Wars movie. The new trailer for the third and final movie in the second Star Wars trilogy, Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker, was released last week and dominated the internet. It was immediately the number one trending video on YouTube and set a new record for number of pre-sale tickets. The movie opens on December 20th. Do you plan on seeing it over holiday break? That's all for Top Trending. See you next week. Hello, my name is Sam and welcome to the sports for this week. On Monday, October 28th, the Greenwood girls, sixth grade girls basketball team will be at Triton playing at five. On Wednesday, October 30th, the sixth grade girls basketball team will be playing Indian Creek at Greenwood at 530. Have a great week, everybody. Thanks for watching this week's episode of GMS News. I'm Davis. And I'm Ava. Please visit our website and our YouTube channel to show ideas and submit suggestions. Have a great week.